What's up, guys, and welcome back. It's Pope John Paul here with Scrim Airsoft. Hello. And we are doing another uh, Wrath of Sparta part. I think we're on to part 24 now. Yep, part and, 24. And we are very much uh, on the offensive end now. End game yeah. and on the offensive. We are in the end game. There are a lot of uh, settlements to carve our way through, but there is literally one army which consists of militia hoplites and a javelinman. Yeah, we just need uh, to... I say that singular. We need to uh, just take out the, like, <laughs> the toe settlements, as I'm going to call them, like the three-toed settlements. Yeah, that'll be a bit of a... Because he's building an army as well. That's not something I want on my flank. Yeah. Um, and then we just carve all the way through, and we take over Sestos and Marina. And I think there's only one more in the south, like yeah, Kos. There we go, Kos. Yeah, that I'm, was it. I'm trying to get to Kos with a fleet, but it's a bit of a problem. Because only you're surrounded by the enemy on all sides. Yeah. And the Ionian League, which we're yet to break on the naval game. Yeah, and we still need to take Andros, actually. I still haven't retaken that. Andros? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Andros. The one, <laughs> the one I burnt to the ground. Yeah. Oh, well. well. We'll get there, I'm sure. Yeah, we'll get there. In the meantime, I need to start building up this new settlement. Well, I say new settlement. The Macedonia's capital is basically mine. So I need to make sure it's happy because I'm not dealing with more rebellions because, my God... So we're going to build a barracks in there, we're going to build a forum in there, and we're going to go for uh, pit mines, because that's manufacturing, and manufacturing is good. Manufacturing is good because it gets us lost to money, especially in a time of winter where I'm down to 1,400 quid. Yeah, I'm not doing too well with 17 and a half now, but um, I don't think there's much else I can do, because I'm, I'm very much uh, restricted to food. Food is a, a bit low at the moment, so we're we just going to carry them. I've got three, but oh. it's not enough to really upgrade anything with either. I have 17. <laughs> 17. Oh, wow, okay. You, you've you got your farming game up. Yeah. It's kind of handy because I was just thinking, well, it's the only problem, it's the only thing holding me back on upgrading stuff, so like barracks and such like, so. Oh, I just realized my army still needs replenishing, but there's a lovely little settlement here. And the army's pulled away. Don't know where they're going. Don't really care, to be honest. Um, I'm just going to carry on pushing my spy into the land to see what they're up to. Not a lot, I'm guessing. Um, there's not a lot more else I can do, really. Yeah, I'm just going to pass on to you, I suppose. Let's see my politics. Um, yeah, no civil wars, please, Scrim. <laughs> no, they're all happy with me. Uh, because I uh, overcame succession with plus 34. But when that disappears... We are talking about a minus eight possibility, but Ooh. that's for the future. <laughs> that's future scrim. That's future stuff. I think I also hired a woman to help me. Yeah, I did. What am I going to do with her? What do I do with her? I don't know. What do you do with her? I mean, I can intrigue, send Emrys three. What, what, you're only another noble, though. You, I don't know what to do with you. I just got you. Yeah, I've uh, got one oh, like that as well. I can get my guy to seek a spouse. No, I'm not going to do that. Not gonna do any of that. Loyalty for target party send emissary. Nah, I don't need to worry about any of that. Yep, I guess we'll just crack on. I need. Ah, okay. Ship's built. Oh, one ship. Festival of the, ship. the gods. So that means if you want to all read that, there it is. Um, Poseidon smiles on us. Plus five percent wealth from so all sources for one Happy go. days. Very good. Right, now I have one job, and that is to take Antigonia from the Macedonians, their last settlement, and we will also resolve. And there we go, Macedon is gone. Happy days. That rival in the north. All gone. Well, I yeah, know. it's just got some random scraps of armies around. Antigonia had two different barracks in it. Jesus. I never knew you'd get to. Must be the faction. Um, it just built a muster field and a hoplite barracks so it's just like I think it was going to go down I don't know what it was doing it was just very any... uh, yeah, I don't, I don't, I just, uh, no I don't know what it was doing I can get hippie slow now <laughs> happy day oh yeah you must have level 3 now don't you yeah I've got now I, can, I guess I can now get rid of the one in the layer as well I'll get rid of that one I'm planning to go down that route. I'm moving my uh, barracks from Igea into Arnissa because it makes sense. Yeah. To me, anyway. A layer just means like a uh, layer also is like a walled city, so it's like there's endless things I can do there. Right. Let's sabotage this uh, general because that allows me to level up the spy. 
That would be always handy. Be successful, be successful, be successful. Hey, you're good now. I mean, level Happy days. level four is not that good, but... <laughs> hey, we're getting I've got there. a... Oh, I've got a spies level five. Mine's better than yours. <laughs> not for long. No, I'm not using mine for much. I'm just kind of scouting. Fair enough. Um, I'm going to... Um, yeah, we'll go careful. Make her more careful so she's basically like no other agent can hurt her. It's always Happy handy. Um, oh, I actually have a level 3 uh, barracks in Norcopotus. Oh, fair enough. Well, we'll leave that there. <laughs> right, could I take Andros? Probably not with that 20 stack still there. And they have a lot of food there. I, oh, yes, I'm building up an army to get ready to take on Andros. That was it. So we need probably some more slingers. Slingers, good. Always good. Do we have... And we're getting more hoplites. Okay. Um, this fleet of mine that's like... And this fleet, this army that I've had from the very beginning has done absolutely fuck all. all like The champions of Hercules. Uh, no, the Heracladia that are like in Naxos. They're just <laughs> so far away, they, and they've just done nothing all like serious. They're just really. sat there, they're quite happy. Yeah, they are. Poor them. <laughs> right, we'll build more Marines. Always handy. More Marines. Marines. Uh, Marines. Uh, exactly. Don't leave any men behind. Right, I'm going to. Unless you're Sparta, then you leave 300 of them behind at any one time. Yeah, that is true. But they were a bit mean. Um, I'm going to just stay where I am for the moment because there's some pretty <coughs> st strong Macedonian armies that haven't been damaged by Ooh, attrition still yet. Yeah, they haven't been damaged by attrition. So I'll end the turn. Oh no, I won't. I've got a... Um, Sons of Ares have a tradition. Okay. Public order is always handy. Enables construction of medium siege engines or store defenders, maybe. I'll go with siege engines because that could be handy in later, in like the last few capital, uh, places. Yeah, we'll with, with the siegings, yeah, that'll be somewhat useful. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Athens. Oh, it's moved out from Andros. Ooh. I could take that with a uh, with a fleet. Might as well. I might try it. Okay, and Sparta's doing stuff that I don't like around Corinth. Oh, I've got a Spartan army outside my uh, my main capital as well. Oh, I mean, I think they're just getting ready to attack both as uh, like systematically. Nah. <laughs> just don't be silly, Pope. They're not gonna do that. They're so gonna do that. Yeah. What, what, we're in February, so we're nearly out of winter. Oh, so hopefully it will be March. We we'll get hopefully. our winter. Oh, I, I want my money. I want my money too. Persian Empire doing stuff. I just can't hope the Persians go well. Athens and Ionian League, you're really weak. We're just gonna kill you. <laughs> oh, if only. No, we're still in winter. <laughs> and I actually know. lost more income, believe it or not. Yeah, me too. Actually, I'm plague of Athens. Oh. You Great. got another one. Another 12 turns of that. Yeah. On top of the over 20. Let's just say Athens just is just not going to get better. Yeah, I think that's the whole idea though, isn't it? It's because like during this period, Athens just had a huge, a lot of play going on. Uh, oh, one more turn. My hammers of meh, meh, meh will be finished. <laughs> There'll be two armies in the field. Uh, I don't think there's a lot more I could do. Uh, I'm kind of restricted with food again, and I'm building a major city, so yeah, I really can't build anymore. Okay. Anything that doesn't cost food. No, you cost food, you cost food, you are food itself. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, this this has been a fun turn. I was quickly upgrading my generals. <laughs> fun turn, yeah. Oh, okay. All the Macedonians decided to all raid in my lands. Excellent. <laughs> Best way to do it. Take yeah. all the gold we can. Uh, you are going to reduce upkeep. Replenishment rates increase. Yeah, we're just going to go for that. There's no question about that. Um, yeah, we'll end our turn. Right, I've got a few things to build. So I'm going to build a subterranean aqueduct to get more growth. 
Okay, maybe I'm not. <laughs> there we go. Like, everything came through all of a sudden. It's like, end turn? Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, more plagues in Athens. Brilliant. Research Yay. done. Um, there we go. Subterranean Our... aqueduct. What were you I was gonna say, I remember how proud you were capturing Athens. Is that is that is that still kind of a pride thing at the moment? Yeah, I've got to say it's something. I'm now in minus two hundred to go, actually. Oh god. But it's because I've Sorry. produced a l load more armies, and I but yeah, I am like got four armies nearly at full stack, three fleets on the go. I'm like yeah, I've got, I should be contributing more. I've got two armies. I I am like repping a lot of. Manpower right now. Hmm. Although I am plunging now into the heartland of uh, Athens, so. Good, good. good. Byzantium's going through attrition at the moment. It must be out of food. Oh, no, they're in the mountains, that's why. Go for marine training. What does that allow me to do? Oh, it allows me to. Oh, I actually doesn't do anything. <laughs> no, then I'll... I will go for damage. I'll go for. I'll go for damage and ships. Right. I could attack. We may have a big fleet battle on our hands. Oh. Oh. Possibly. Bit of naval warfare. Possibly. I don't know what comes out, though, if I attack. I don't know. Where are you attacking Andros? Andros. I could attack their army, which is all transports at the moment. You would do a lot of damage if you did that. Yeah, I know. I'm just thinking that. I just don't know whether to bring up my army in support. Just uh, no, you're trying. To, mm, I would say hit and run. Yeah, it's just Smash that. It's just mm, yeah, yeah. I'll do it. Go on, let's hit him. Hit them. Oh, hit them hard. Hit them I fast. could auto resolve this or fight this. It's sixty. I'll fight it. I'm gonna. Mm. I'm gonna rue the day that I did that. But oh. Is this a transport fleet versus a transport fleet? No, transport fleet versus a proper fleet. Oh, yeah, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Yeah, no, got you. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, you're in for an uh, interesting battle. <laughs> Anything I can really do is just charge you and land on your ships and just fight you. But yeah, I don't you even have... know if transport fleets can ram. No, I don't think they can, but you have more men on your boats. Actually, no, you might be able to ram. But it's just not as effective. Like you're probably gonna like hit my ship, probably take a Break lot of damage. Break it to myself. Yeah. <laughs> They're too strong, Captain. We're just going down. Well, it's a lovely day for it. I can tell you that much. There's some lovely mountains of it. There's uh, oh, what's this? Is there a whale here? <laughs> a whale? In uh, I've, I've, I've I've actually fought battles where little whales come up, and I'm like, oh, look at that. Yeah, I mean that seems very unrealistic though, because like. There were never whales, I don't think, in the Mediterranean. I mean, prove me wrong. If so someone's watching, it's like, there was whales in the Mediterranean, you lie. I feel like I should search this up concerning I work with animals. I feel stuff. like I feel like it's something you should search up later. Mm. Whales in the Mediterranean. Were there, was it a real thing? I would have thought not. Maybe, like, in the time... In the that, ancient times. Yeah, in the dinosaurs... I mean, if, I mean, they do. I mean, they do say there were mammoths when the Egyptians were building the pyramids, so it might not be totally impossible. Yeah, that's true. That's mad, to be fair, when you think about that. The Egyptians. It is, isn't it? The Egyptians built them so long ago, and that, that there were still mammoths around. I know. That's just put things in perspective. You think mammoths? You think like cavemen and stuff? It's like, no, they they were building pyramids. They were the, probably the most powerful ancient civilization of their time. Yeah, and, and we still and we everyone still, else came across. Yeah, I was gonna say we still can't even build pyramids to this day, really. I mean, it's not. We probably could. It's just not very economical to. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably the reason, because like, it's all just for show. Then wasn't it? They didn't really do it like. Well, it was tombs, wasn't it? I mean, yeah, but it, again, it's like to show off your wealth. If you could. Yeah, very true. You, you, you had a bigger big, pyramid. Yeah. I have a bigger pyramid than you, so my death's going to be better than yours, or something like that. I don't know. See, it's the entire world of the male world, isn't it? Who's got the biggest what? Yeah, exactly. Whoever's got the biggest what. And then they decided that they realised that, oh, we actually get robbed, so we better build them underground instead. <laughs> <laughs> Still got robbed anyway. Yeah, they did. Um, and, and the British Empire came along and went, huh? Our empire was bigger than yours, and now I'm going to steal your body. Yeah, and rob what's left anyway. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, good old Egyptians just robbing each other. What a broken yeah. economy they must have had. Just like on. Yeah. Okay. We're just gonna rob from the from the graves of those that are so, like. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Well. Well, this is for some reason taking a little longer than expected. But well, I'm getting. Lots, just... I'm getting lots of uh, quotes from Aristotle, so that's okay. Here we go. There we oh, go. There we go. Yay! I can't wait to lose. <laughs> that's a nice formation you've got there yeah. to start off with. <laughs> yeah, literally, I can only like attack you and stuff like that. So, I don't really know. Apparently, what Barons I'm of going Power to... is uh, very much not my favorite anymore. That's probably because they. Think... Yes, it does say that actually. It's probably because it thinks numbers. Yeah, it's probably not taking into consideration the fact that you can ram the crap out of me and I can't. Yeah. And I, I'm not terrible at naval battles. I've found a system that works really well, in fact. Mm -hmm. But I'm not great at micromanaging. Uh, naval battles, if at all. Uh, me neither, so we've got that to enjoy together. Boy. I mean, my actual navy ships, which I've got four of. You actually have four navy ships, Q. I do have four <laughs> navy ships. I'm trying to find them. Are they coming in as reinforcements? So. I think they are. Yes, in fact, they are coming in as reinforcements. Uh, you've got to hold out until uh, then. <laughs> Even then, you might not win. <laughs> Yeah, I think. Bollocks. Um, okay, you might need to give me a second while I think about this. Uh, that's definitely going to be like that. That's definitely going to be like that. Right, let's group you two together. I'm going to get you guys to do. I'm going to be really this. upset. If, upset if I lose a single boat though, because <laughs> they're all really elite. Free. It's inevitable you're going to lose something, I think. Shh, scream, don't say that. <laughs> I don't okay. want to do it. But i got to do it for the greater cause of the... I mean, I think if I recruit something, it gets instant chevrons anyway, so... It's not too bad. I'd say my units, they get, like, silver chevrons now at this point. Uh, mine do. <laughs> We're not that good, scream. <laughs> okay, I think I'm ready... Okay, off. Oh, Wait, what have you done? Oh, right, that's what you've done. Okay. We're just gonna... Bollocks to it. Oh, Alright, forgot about those two. I'm uh, sorry, I forgot about you guys. Uh... <laughs> this just sounds it's a such pain. a slow start. It's just like, mm, come on. I'm not even gonna bother having the hood up because, like, at this point, I just click on like the ships. That's like, it's not like uh, in a field battle where I know where everyone is. It's like a, with a ship battle, it just becomes chaos instantly. Uh, where, where, where am I? There they are. Yeah, an entire unit has already perished. Yeah, there we go. There goes another. Yeah, the, the problem is you're just... Mm. Oh, shit. You actually hit one. Yeah, I've got a few. Ah! I've just gone really Shit. silent. Uh. Oh, your ship's on fire. Is it? Oh. Oh, that was a bit of a ding. That didn't look too good either. Oh, fuck. Okay, yeah, you're going down, aren't you? Guys, can you just do something? I'm getting really scared. Mm. Are we? I'm running out of units here. Oh, there we go. That they're gonna go. Yeah, they're gone. Okay. I see you chasing my general. No, oh, my general's fallen. Oh, oh you boy. got one of my ships though. Did I? Yeah, I saw you just destroyed one. Like, with an go instant on, hit. Go on, go on, go on. Oh, fuck. 
Oh. Ah, run away, run away. Oh, that's, that ship's so dead. Go on, you get one more in. Get one more in. You can get one more it's in. It's annoying because the they're getting destroyed by... There we go. <sighs> I'm just going to end the battle because I think there's no point. They just instantly, like... They get stuck on the wreckages that appear below. And it's like, no, you're on a perfect ramming course. And then they go, nope, can't reach. There's a mast in the way. Just break it. You've broken already like a dozen boats. Lost. I lost one. One boat. It's the one that you, you rammed. Lost. A few. Yeah. One boat entirely. Oh, no, I actually lost three. Lost three. Wow. Yeah, you lost three. It's only your range units, though, so you're not... I wouldn't say that a total failure. Yeah, that's true. It's a, it's, hmm, yeah. You going in for a kill? Yeah. <laughs> 96%. So I was just sat there looking at Andros and I just heard the horn and I was like, yeah. <laughs> yep, I know what's happened. Is there nothing else? Yep, and they're gone. Yeah, now it just leaves them with uh, a garrison, which I can take. Very easily, so 98. Excellent. And we're taking Andros in the way I didn't plan to take it. Happy days. Yeah, and I'm getting more food from it. We've got a little glass salmon there as well. Yeah, that's handy. Um, could I just take over the rebels and have the entire province. I could, Scrim, but you know, why would I do that? <laughs> yeah, exactly. There's two full stacks plus a garrison, so that's, you know, good luck. Exactly. Um, right, let's attack. Oh, we can't reach, of course. Right, I'm just going to have to chase down these goddamn, like, harassing... Um, harassing. Harassing Macedonians. I'm trying to think of the word that they're called. Oh, you're over on that side of the map now. I'm just moving my camera over to wherever it is. I can't see anything, but I'm sure it looks yeah. fantastic. Oh, I mean, it's it's there's not that much fantastic stuff going on. Antogia. Antogia is being left to its own devices now. I mean, I actually probably need to pull back and probably... Yeah, probably do, actually. Yeah, public order's pretty down, though. Yeah, because I pulled that whole army out to deal with the... Reb uh, not rebels, Macedonians. They are basically rebels at this point. <laughs> oh, they are now. So, I've spent about 20 turns dealing with mine. Right, so we're one, da one less... Uh, Mass uh, Athenian settlement. Now it's just uh, Kos in the south, and then it's a bit in the north. Excellent. Looks like I'll be pushing into the north quite soon. Okay. On my way to Linfos, so. Excellent. <laughs> right. Looks like they've abandoned the settlements. I've built army that's being built. Gone. I've got master shipwrights. Five percent health for all ships. Five percent mm. ramming bonus for all units. Happy days. Yeah, you're no, you're not destroying my boats again, boy. <laughs> right, then we bring down administration. Then we're going to start re replacing those ships that you destroyed. I'm not sorry. <laughs> I'm not sorry. I did what I did. Apparently, I'm upgrading my archers, but for the life of me, I can't remember why. Better arrows. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Better arrows. They now have missile on their points. <laughs> we were just firing twigs before, sir. <laughs> One man even threw his bow at him because it was better. <laughs> it was made of solid wood. In like these twigs. There's still a lot what? of factions left, actually, in this late part of the game. Still there on. are, yeah. Ellis has been retaken by the Acanian League, so Sparta's having... Sparta. Oh, is, Sparta's at war. Sparta can't deal with a one city state. Jeez. Ooh, it, God. It's just not worthy yeah. of being called Wrath of Sparta when Sparta, unless it's played by. Sparta is just not done very much, has they? Oh, Persia's getting very close. Is it? Oh. Yeah, Brothers in Arms. It's uh, gone towards Tyrone. They're in striking distance of Tyrone. Yeah, they've been like. I can't see that at the moment, but. Um, yeah, I will admit they've been. Uh, going around there a little bit when I was um, in control of the north. Um, I got a food shortage. Oh dear. Oh dear. I don't know why. I'm going to have to cancel my building a massive city. <laughs> Just very irritating. I've been building huge cities. Now I have to. End. Oh, that's why. Yeah, so my huge army is now currently being destroyed through attrition. Oh. That's okay. We'll take over a Lymphos. 
Uh, we've got a 99% chance, I think. I can hear the yep. horns. We're just going to, you know, 99%. Gonna... Not sure we're going to win. Let the computer deal with it. <laughs> it's fine. Let him deal. Oh, he's got some lead. I lost 12 men. Wow. You're so... <laughs> Jesus. Now we both have some lead as well. Oh, yep. Yeah, there he goes. Just gone purple. Got some lead. And I've got... Mm. Well, I've got some form of food anyway. Good. I need to downgrade something very quickly. Maybe some, like, maybe your barracks and Thebes or something. Get rid of it because you're not producing stuff there anymore. Oh, is there a barracks and Thebes? I don't know. I presume there is because it's your capital. No. Oh, you don't Nothing know. there. Um, uh, let's think fast. Uh, I'm just going to demolish this marketplace. Ooh. Does it put it down by one level, or does it completely destroy it? I think it destroys it entirely. Little bugger. Um, okay, we're going to go towards destroying the barracks up north, then, because I only need two armies for the time being. And I'm moving it around anyway. Okay, and because Byzantium decided that they would try and charge for the uh, Macedonian all capital, it will be met by my forces. I shall destroy them. Essentially. Oh, I should have not. I should have built instead of a homestead. I should have built a um, a temple because I could do with converting the culture here. Ah well. Can you convert the culture? Because I I don't think you can in this one. Do you not think so? No, because oh, no I. Point. Then what's the point in building temples? Because if you get to the big ones, they give you little buffs. Do they? And they give you public order, which is actually oh, yeah. quite decent. Oh, like, well, yeah. I've got the Mega Zeus, which gives me twenty. Like, 24 public order, like, 20% from all sources and stuff, so... Oh, I should definitely be building, then, in, like, one, then. Oh, okay. I should... Oh. Does Poseidon give you more food? No. I remember the... If you ask him nicely. Oh, it does, actually. Yeah, Temple Poseidon gives you more food. <gasps> hmm. I might have to go down that, because that will get all the food back. That you probably sp invest into... Building a level three temple. Food. Definitely going to do that. I'll ha also have a purpose for now. My one in Corinth. I can just show it off and just go. Yeah, we've got a really impressive temple. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty much. I was just literally just building stuff. I've taken over Olympos. Uh Mende needs to go because they do. Uh, yeah, it's just bits and pieces, really. I should build a uh, better temple. Oh, I've already got a temple in Paros, so we'll build that. That up really good, really well. So, okay, rebellion imminent in Epirus. Festival of Zeus, more public order, excellent. Um, so we're definitely gonna. Oh dear, you sneezing, you sneezing, boy. Hey, fever. Hey, oh. So that time oh. of the year. Aye, that time. That's bloody hate summer. I don't like some of those. The wasps. Wasps annoy me. Wasps are pretty bad. That's the only reason. All right, we've killed one Macedonian army. Just a couple more. Right, what's well, uh, I could release them, get the wealth. Yeah, I'll release them. The army's destroyed. Get the money from it. Why not? Money, money, money. Right, so let's build a better, um, better shrine then in Corinth, if that's the case with the uh, awesome-looking... Uh, temples. Sparta's still got armies like full of Spartan youths and Perioikoi hoplites, which are pretty god awful. I think it's because he's got so many armies that are just all cheap units. Yeah. Must be the case. Oh, okay, so the uh, Aetolian League are starting to now make more professional looking armies. Hoplites. Aetolian and... League? Yeah, the people between some of my lines. Oh, yeah, yeah. I've let live. Foolishly. Yeah, so uh, Sparta's paying for that price. Yeah, possibly. Oh no, not the and um, they're the Acanian leagues. That's the I'm talking about the one that's between me and Oh that those guys, firm on stuff, yeah. yeah. Yeah, they're they're doing stuff. Right. And I'm gonna build The a, capital's undefended. I could take it, but they have another city. <laughs> um Right, let's replace another one of those ships that you destroyed. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, absolutely not. Get away. Oh, and enemy transports. The Ionian League bringing up another 20. 
Excellent. <laughs> Just another 20 to destroy. destroy. Yeah. Exactly. I'm going to force um, my fleet over to Kos. It's going to take me two turns to get there. Mm -hmm. And then I can... Well, one more turn, I think, actually. And then I can take it. And then we only have to deal with the Athens in the north. Right, I'm going to end my turn. Oh, no, I'm not. I've got a skill for someone. One with the Griffin's Grace. Excellent, right. So ammunition, maybe, or upkeep. We'll do upkeep, actually. Get more money. Money! Money, money, money. I'm going to see how badly my forces get attritioned by my Ooh. lack of food. Athens is sending a fleet to attack my fleet. And it's quite an even battle. Oh. I'm going to pull back I think I don't know why I'm gonna pull back see if Athens attacks again because it actually sends me nearer to Kos mm. so reinforcements yeah oh no 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 well reinforcements for them it would be but they actually went back the other way so it's actually that moves allowed me to get nearer to Kos without using any movement points so I actually might be able to reach in one go okay I've still got my like cursor and stuff oh down in Kos yeah yeah yeah, so I'm I'm gonna get there next turn, so we should be able You're to. You have to garrison the crap out of that one. Um, yeah, I'm, well, I've got a fleet. So hey, just, what are you doing? I'll just garrison it with the fleet, and if they try and attack, then they attack. Uh, Byzantium is um, annoying me. Oh, is it? What's it doing? Sending agents. An army. Oh. To Larissa. Oh. Ah. By a boat. Okay, you might just want to like sink it. I can't. I've got nothing to stop it, really. Apart from my armies, which are going into the lands. Oh. Macedon is pulling back into the old homeland as well. Yeah, Macedon's just kind of like running around raiding like, this is how we're going to live, boys. We're going to take out some farmers and keep our mercenary armies. Make Alexander proud. <laughs> I'll do rape and pillage. Mercenary armies hired. So what do you want us to do? Um, I'm going to ask you, I'm going to need Ooh. you to raid farmers. Uh, we'll do hunted. Uh, generals increase rank. Level ten general. That's the top rank, I think. Oh, I found a Macedonian army. Right. What? Well, it's twelve men. I have no idea how powerful they are. I could just raise an army here, <laughs> but it takes like five turns for it to build. Hey, I'm back in the money though. Four grand. Yeah, four and a half for me as well. Very nice. Um, you could raise so, one. Or oh. what do you think? What's Larissa's garrison like? Uh. Pretty poor. Okay. But I have just taken out Mende, which is where they came from, so... Oh, have you take? Have you destroyed it? Yeah, there's just no garrison to it. Fair enough. I've... Yeah, it's not changed for me yet. Not changed. Oh, I could loot it for nearly four grand as well. Oh, that's but, that's why you're still debating what you're doing oh, with it. Oh, my Imperium just increased. Ooh. What have I got now? Plus ten loyalty. Mm, that works. And... Uh, minus 10 diplomacy with Persia. Oh, God, I need to be careful with that. <laughs> I don't think Persia really likes anyone, though, to be honest, Scrim, so don't worry about very, it. Very, very true. Uh, I'm not really sure what Mende's meant to be. You're a commerce place, so you can be a marketplace. It's you can stay. wine. It has indeed got wine. Get drunk on your wine. Uh... Right, Tyrone is now next on my target list. Um, I'm worried because I've got an army heading towards Agia mm -hmm. and one heading towards Larissa. Ooh. I don't know which one I should be really uh, tackling first. Agia or... Um, I would have thought go for Larissa because... Defend Larissa because your army in Mende can always swing back around and get Agia. Or I can yeah. always come in and support you and take so it. I'll go, I'll go back down to Larissa. Okay. Uh, Tyrone is going to be next after Mende. You're taking all my old lands, and I'm I'm a bit annoyed, <laughs> but at the same time, I'm not there to take them, so you take <laughs> them. Uh, let's see what diplomacy is looking like. The Iconian League. Oh, not a lot going on. Byzantium, how are we doing, buddies? You want some peace? No, you don't want any peace. You can't leave me high and dry with Byzant Byzantium. <laughs> Not allowed. Trade agreement with Thingy Mobobbers down south? No. Persian Empire. Really don't like me. Persian 
like I said, Persia's not going to like anyone. If it, unless you like Sparta and you're nearly losing the game, or Athens and you're nearly losing the game. Pretty much, yeah. Uh, what's your special ability, by the way, AG? 25 wealth and manufacturing. Well, we know where we're going with that. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think that's me for the turn. Yours uh, cap upgrade. Your capital Thebes, it's got a larger outskirts than it does city, nearly. It's like, it's like the suburbs is outside, <laughs> oh, yeah. outside the walled city is huge. Oh, what am I doing here? Um, is this a level level ten is the maximum your general can get to, isn't it? I believe so. Yeah. Oh, I've literally got to pick my next skill very carefully. Uh, yep, tax skill that'll work. What well, conversion? Conversion does nothing. Yes, we'll have that one. Uh, authority when leading an army. Uh, no, we don't need that one. That one. Oh, no. No no no, 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 these are all crap. Uh, one experience game rate for infantry units. Yes, please. It's going to be a pretty beefy army. Yeah. Oh, actually, my fleets get instant unit three, uh, rank three. Happy Jeez. days. That is too good, some would say. Right. Okay, Rose is trying to send an army uh, through trip by transports to Athens. So we send... Oh, yeah, I should have warned you about that. Sorry. It's all right. Oh, Macedon declared war on the Aetolian League. What? <laughs> Why? What are they Did... trying to do? Are they... Do they need... Do they desperately need that much... Uh, like, a city that bad? They must do. Right, I'm going to keep going down my marine training. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Sparta, Sparta seems to be just free real estate at the moment. Yeah, it really is. Like Sparta and um, just like the whole area is... Oh, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Just like... It's... Basically, it's fucked. It basically is destroyed. Right. Oh, oh yeah. Rose is taking Crenfira again. Oh, yeah, yeah. They kept going. That's a back and forth war between those two. <laughs> right. Anyway, let's try and get to Kos. That's what I was trying to... Yeah, I think I'm within a one... Oh, maybe. I've kind of gone a bit north of it. <gasps> yeah, I can. I can reach it in one go. Cos. <gasps> bum, bum, bum. That's the capital. Yes, right. I'm going to just take it for 80%. Yeah, that's a pretty good ratio. And then we will have to wrap up the episode there, I think, with us taking another Athenian settlement and getting another step closer. Oh, I've increased my Imperium. Okay, so an army's allowed 10, fleet's 10. S number of edicts can be enacted per turn two spies and stuff increase well that means that everyone hates me even more <laughs> yeah sounds about Yay. right there are literally one two three four five six seven settlements of athens left hurrah and they're all within my gaze i can actually get roads and stuff like that if i wanted to i could probably t yeah i could take like hillicans you you yeah you could probably yeah, there's another there's another iron settlement i never knew that is there another one? Lindos. Oh my gosh. Uh, just another South Rose. There's an iron settlement. I never knew there's one. Excellent. Another one. I mean, Persia might have one as well, for all we know. Probably does. <laughs> Probably. I mean, they are there just to basically screw with you. So. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be fun going into the next episode with that iron. Well, that uh, settlement. I'm probably going to uh, have a little bit of money. I'm going to. Money, money, money. Money, money, money. I'm going to build. Oh, no, I want to build Javis. Right, Javis, and then we will do a skill of um, melee attack, I think. We'll have fighter melee attack. Okay, so I think that will have to wrap up the episode for today, guys. So if you've enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe for more awesome content here. And go check out Scrim's channel as well for his perspective. And until next time, guys, bye for now.